Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be unboxing January's BoxyCharm. Don't worry about my hair. My hair is growing out finally and it's growing uneven and I hate it. I cannot wait till this grows down past my ears at least. Because I can't even like tuck it behind my ears right now. But anyways, yep, we're unboxing BoxyCharm. So if you like these kind of videos, keep watching. So today is our BoxyCharm. I cut it open right here so it will be easy to open on video. And then we open it up. And the theme of the box this month is Boxy and Chill. And then on the back is all the products. So we got these cards back again. So when we get these cards, it's usually everybody in the box has the same thing. But I don't think that can be the case because there's three different palettes. Mm -hmm. So yeah, the first thing I'm pulling out is this Briagio Don't Despair Strength and Moisture Leave-In Mask. I got one of these from Ipsy before. So I know that this is a sample size. Because <clears throat> I looked for this online and all I could find was 4 ounce and this is 2 ounce. But I don't mind. I like putting this on when I get out of the swimming pool at the YMCA because your hair gets very damaged by chlorine. The next thing we got here is an eyeliner. And it's by the company Star Looks. And it's in brown. Ultra Lux Long Wear Eye Pencil. I'm just gonna try and open it. Um, I'll open it at the. I'll do swatches at the end. The next thing we got is this Ofra Long Lasting Lip Liquid Lip. In I assume the color is a Havana Nights. This is a little dark for me, so I do not know if I will be keeping this, but we'll see. And then we got two of these Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Masks. Um, I assume it might be a Korean brand. I don't know. It's in English and French. We got English on this side and then French on this side. So maybe it's not a Korean brand. I don't know, but I know that these are like really expensive. And then the last thing we got is this Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Volume 3 eyeshadow palette. So that's everything I got in my box. And then for the for the card here thingy, it says Briagio. This super moisturizing and strengthening leave-in conditioner provides reparative benefits and beyond. Its unique formulation of micro encapsulate Regulated argan oil and an optimal blend of transforma transformative nutrients that include B vitamins, coconut oil, algae extract, and biotin help to promote healthy hair that will leave you looking your very best. $16. So, this is a very expensive brand if you only get 2 ounces for $16. The next thing is the Ofra lipstick. This matte liquid lipstick delivers long-lasting color that perfectly <laughs> outlines and fills in lips. Excuse me. The stunning pigment stay put all day with minimal transfer while maintaining a comfortable wear. Infused with vitamin A and anti 
antioxidants your lips will look and feel healthy all day so twenty dollars so 16 and 20 that's 36 dollars so far the next one is the Tarte limited edition rainforest of the sea highlighting eyeshadow palette I knew it was the highlighting one maybe I might keep it now Dive into this vegan crease-free eyeshadow palette that features seven highly reflective plush micro shimmers and one matte nude that serves as the perfect transition shade. This blendable and long wear formula is enriched with vitamin E and antioxidants, helping to hydrate and protect the lids. $36. And then the next thing is the Tatcha Luminous Dewy Face Mask 2-Pack. Nourish skin from within using this lightweight blend of rice germ oil, vitamin E, essential fatty acids, and highly concentrated botanical oils and extracts. Each mask is designed to designed for maximum absorption, delivering 20 mil, milliliter of skin quenching serum and imparting an instant dewy luminous glow, a scientifically perfected trio of fermented Japanese anti- Aging superfoods like green tea, rice, and algae instantly restore skin's health and radiance. $24. So if it has Japanese, where was it? Japanese anti-aging superfoods in it, then this must be like a Japanese brand maybe. I don't know. But I will try those. And then the last thing is the Star Lux Lux Eye Longwear Eye Pencil. Star Lux expands into a mechanical eye pencil with a launch exclusively to BoxyCharm. The intensively pigmented formula delivers a beautiful color that lasts all day. The easy to extend and retractable pen makes application and continuously use seamlessly easy without have ever having to use a pencil sharpener. This is my dream pencil. I hate wooden pencils and I hate anything that has to be sharpened. And it's brown and I don't think we've ever gotten a brown eyeliner in BoxyCharm since I've been with them. So definitely we'll keep that. And that's $19. So let's add up all the prices. 16 and 20 is 36. And then 36 is 72. So everything in this box is $115. And I paid $21. So that's a good deal. So I thought I wasn't too happy with this box. But now that I found out this is the highlighting palette, I'm excited. I want to try this. I already know I love this. And I'll try this. This is the only thing that I'm iffy about. I wish it was a lighter color like a berry or a nude. But anyways. <laughs> next will be our swatching portion. Okay, so now we are going to be swatching these products. The first thing I'm going to swatch is the lipstick. It smells good anyways, but it is quite dark, so I do not know if I'll be keeping that. Maybe my daughter would, um, let me try to get it into better light. Oh, I think that's too much light. Here. And that's the color of the lipstick and then the eyeliner 
I took all the packaging off before I restarted the video. I'm not a lefty, so it's really hard for me to. I really like that. It goes on nice and smooth. Just trying to get out of your guys' light. I hope you guys can see that. Every time I want to record, the sun comes. <clears throat> Let me see if I can move this way. I just don't want to drop the camera. Let me try to move this way. Maybe that will be better. And then... I'm excited to see this, but I will let you guys see it first. If I can open it. There's a nice big mirror. Plastic thingy fell out. And that's the colors. Now let me see them. Ooh. Pretty. So I'm going to swatch some. Escape. Some of them are like you have to like dip in twice. Let me like pick up my phone for a second. And there's all the swatches from the palette. They're all very like subtle shades. These would be good for like um, a going to work palette. So there's my palette. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new, hit that subscribe button. And until next time, bye.